quick tips for coding in Unity number one. In game development, normalized vectors are commonly used to represent directions without considering distance. Their length is always one, which makes them scale uniformly, useful for operations like dot products or averaging, as we're doing here. The green line represents the average of two vectors, the red and blue lines. Notice that while the red and blue vectors both touch the outer white circle, the green line does not. That's because averaging places this endpoint directly between the endpoints of the red and blue vectors, resulting in a shorter length every time. Now, if we were to stretch the red vector so that it's longer than the blue one, the green line adjusts to reflect the midpoint between their endpoints. This highlights what happens if the vectors being averaged aren't normalized first. Unequal lengths distort the result. To calculate a proper average direction, we always start with normalized vectors and remember to renormalize the result after averaging or combining them. Thankfully, renormalization is easy to do using the vector's built-in convenience property. This avoids scaling artifacts and ensures consistent directional behavior in your game. Happy coding!